Hello my friends, welcome again. We are in the part 4 now to create Laravel admin panel. Here is our application. Uh, in my database I don't have anything. I have made a artisan migrate fresh. So here I'm going to register a new user. And I'm going to register as a test. Okay, add the password here. A register user and here is our dashboard I'm going to add a new link down there to log out and change the name here so if I go to the code here we are and if I search for the app in the layouts okay first I'm going to change the name to Laraveller and copy the first link here and add it down there but first we need to add the form form with method uh, post and action is going to be the route to logout okay and we need to add the csrf token CSRF token here and now I'm going to pass the link okay change the logout here and if I save come here refresh yeah here is the link uh, add the route to logout here uh, route logout and I'm going to add on click event dot prevent default and this dot closest sorry closest form dot submit and save refresh here and if i click now to log out yeah we are log out and go login again login as a test okay now i want i want to add a, to create a post table and post migration and a model and create some uh, fake posts and display here and after that the user who is logging as a admin can uh, create a post can edit uh, can publish a post the user who is uh, uh, logging as a writer can write a post the other one who is logging as a publisher can publish a post the user who is logging as a user can only view the post Okay, so if I go to the terminal and artisan make model post and dash m for the migration and search for the post here, post migration. Okay, here we are. I'm going to add only the title, uh, table. string title save and uh, I'm going to add the to make a factory for the post and PHP artisan make factory post factory and give it the model post okay hit enter come here and search for the post factory uh, Okay, post factory here, and we need to add only the title. And this faker sentence 
of 5 save and now in the database header we need to add this up models post factory to create a 10 post save and close this one go to the terminal and run the artisan migrate data seed okay come here refresh and we have a 10 posts here cool now i want to display here and for that i have prepared this uh, table you can find in the play italian css.com and this link Okay, uh, copy this one. Open the dashboard. And I'm going to add it here. We need to indent a little bit this. Save and refresh our dashboard. Here is how it look. Uh, I want to add a margin of uh, 6 maybe and we have a BG white here but in the dark mode I want to add the BG to gray 700 and save come here refresh and here is how it look okay for me now just we need to display the pause and if i come here and make a for each okay for each uh, up models post all as a post and we don't need the image and active we only need the title and the id I'll move this up here and add the id here post id and add the post title okay if i save and come here to see what we have refresh yeah hit what is uh, we don't need this uh, uh, image and status up here remove refresh again now now it's okay now i want to when the user is a uh, admin he can uh, edit this post he can publish and he can uh, create a new post i'm going to add a new button here so if i go over here i'm going to add a div with the class full window with the full sorry and href with a class margin 2 and padding 2 and bg green 400 rounded rounded large okay and create post save come here refresh and is here but maybe cut from here and pass it to the, up there save come here refresh okay i'm going to add a margin of two save refresh yeah 
for this video we are done and if you like please subscribe and like this video and see you in the next one thank you very much all the best